everybody, Scott Betts here, and uh, Caleb with Sidekick Caleb, and uh, I'm a little behind on the uh, Ask Anything questions, and so one of the questions that's come in a lot is, what's it like to write a book? Well, initially, when I had the idea to write a book, I was like, uh, cool, I think it'd be cool to write a book, because the I wanted to share the real truck story, because it was just like, average everyday folks that did some really cool stuff from North Dakota where uh, created this company in a basement that grew from a basement to uh, well over to 100 million in sales and like how did you do that and I was gonna write it and then I talked to a buddy of mine and he said but you're not a writer and I thought yeah you're right I'm not a writer so I kind of like put it on hold and didn't think about it and then about a year later some people were pushing me hey you're gonna write that book you're gonna write that book and I thought why not it can't be that hard right too many people have done it and um, Caleb there's we're cruising uh, we're just coming from a book or a, a speaking event in Rapid City and we're on our way back so we're cruising through the prairie of are we South Dakota North Dakota we just got into North Dakota we're back in North Dakota so Anyway, so then I thought, hey, it can't be that hard to write a book. Too many people have done it. Now, that doesn't mean I can write a good book, but so I sat down one weekend. I was going to do a binge weekend, and I wrote, and I wrote, and I wrote, and I wrote, and I was kind of trying to write it like a college paper, so it was really tough. And then uh, a couple of weeks later, I had the idea, why don't I just write whatever comes I'm going to write? And so I did that three more binge weekends, and I had about 100,000 words. And then some uh, got some help from some editors like Caleb was one of the editors unofficial editors yeah. and another editor and they went through it and they kind of organized the book and took the hundred thousand words down to about sixty thousand words and that's how we got to the book principles of fortune there's about forty thousand words left out because it didn't really fit in with the theme of the book um, crafting culture to massively grow a business and it kind of talks about how real we really got the the culture rocking at real truck and how to do that is what the book's about there's another section about a doubtful passenger that was kept out uh, which is about overcoming the doubt in one's mind but it was easier than I thought it would be but it was really hard to get going because I kept thinking well I'm not a writer and what I've learned about book marketing is probably an ask anything question for another book um, but uh, that's my answer on what it's like to write a book and it probably took about well it was about two or three months of the four binge weekends of writing and then it was probably another three months or so of the editors going back and forth and doing the chapters and and organizing the content so it was consumable and my experience in recent releasing the book it's been really awesome because what I hear is people say hey I started reading the book and I couldn't put it down and it's I love all of the actions that I can take right now to improve my business immediately so that was really cool to hear uh, any other thoughts on writing a book Caleb it's worth doing if you think you can do it all right, it's worth doing if you think you can do it. So if I can do it, you can do it, and that's my answer, and I'm sticking to it.